Hello everyone, welcome to the episode number 3 of West Valley. That's it, we are back for another week and we are back for another episode of West Valley. This is a quite special episode because we start building and we start developing the center of this beautiful city um, and uh, it will bring you uh, I would say some of the best thing I, things I have made until now on uh, City Skylines. So uh, I hope you will stay here until the end. Uh, at the end we have the cinematics for all that we have built. And I think it just looks gorgeous, honestly. Uh, meanwhile, I would like to talk to you about some changements that we have that I have been uh, implementing on my life or on my um, media uh, life I would say and uh, I've been streaming uh, for the last two or three days now uh, it will make four days uh, on the day this video comes out uh, I've been streaming um, I have been really, really, really enjoying streaming because um, we are working on West Valley, but not on the city itself, but on a, on a little town on the outskirts of, of uh, West Valley. So uh, I managed to cover everything I do on West Valley that it has not been um, released on video. I, I, I do cover uh, with a, I don't know, in this case, at this moment, there is like a huge building covering uh, episode 3 and 4 because I already uh, started the footage for episode 4 as well. So um, uh, that's it. We have been streaming for uh, four days now and it has been great, 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 great. Uh, I didn't... Uh, thought uh, uh, that I was going to have so many people watching me uh, and when I mean many people I don't mean hundreds of people but I don't know 10 12 uh, I had one day with 16 at the same time so uh, I never thought this was possible at the beginning of, of streaming because it's literally literally the beginning of, of the stream for me and uh, if you want to see more, if you want to see uh, what we are doing outside of West Valley, uh, just come on to Twitch and just take a look at what we are doing there. Uh, the little town is getting so beautiful, so beautiful at this moment. It has a little castle uh, in ruins, but a castle in ruins with a small town down on the near the river on the down side. Uh, taking in consideration the, the castle that's on, on a hill. So uh, I'm really, really enjoying the, steam, the, the streams. I'm really enjoying building that little town. And uh, that's probably the best thing that I could thought about doing, uh, taking in consideration that I don't want to burn myself uh, building West Valley every single day, every single hour. Because I know that in a few days, in a few weeks, in a few months, I will probably be a little bit burned out um, if I do building on this city all the time. So I managed to build on the same map, but on a different town, a little town out on the outskirts of West Valley. And I will be building as well, besides that little town, another town on the other side of West Valley as well. So uh, come come to the, the stream, come check it out what we are doing there. Leave your support, uh, subscribe, uh, leave your follow, uh, leave a comment there. Anything you want, anything it suits, uh, it suits me. Um, talking a little bit about this video. Um, we are six minutes inside the video at this moment. And we are building the central core of this uh, of this city. Um, I wanted to do like a 
plaza here uh, something related with uh, with the church etc so i what i did was uh, i laid down every single church that i had on my that i had subscribed on the workshop uh, i didn't want to go search for more so i just used the ones i had already i did place them and i realized this one here that you are seeing now was probably the best one maybe not too uh, related to the buildings that are next to it um, as uh, i don't know that much about styles renaissance and things like that so uh i just managed to, to to build and to put here the, the one that I liked the most and this one was definitely the one that I liked and I started building around it so uh, I wanted to build a plaza I did manage to get these decals I transformed it into a procedural object and I darkened a little bit uh, this procedural object this decal and it stayed fantastic. The contrast to the to the cobblestone is amazing. I just put it some uh, curves uh, to divide the, those two textures. Now I'm managing to put some uh, trees as, as every uh, single plaza should have, or in most cases they have. So uh, that's what I'm building here. I'm just developing this plaza, enjoying the the time that I that I'm building here at West Valley, and honestly, starting this city was the biggest and the 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 the, the best thing that I could do. It's definitely a much smaller city than the other ones that I started before, uh, in size I would say, but it will be much 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 more fun to do uh, in my own opinion here you see me uh, deploying uh, like a, a obelisk or i don't know how it's called but a little monument as every single plaza has and uh, as it was next to the church i managed to build to put this uh, kind of christ saint I'm not too religious as well, so don't ask me for details because I don't want, I don't know. And uh, <clears throat> I just finalized that that kind of structure there, and I went to build a little bit more around it. Um, here you see me still deploying these uh, textures for the ground, uh, the POs, the curves. And then I started fulfilling a little bit the plaza. What do you usually see in plazas? Well, usually there is always a kiosk here and there selling newspapers, magazines, things like that. I also put it like that small kiosk that serves food and drinks with a little esplanades on the next to it. And now I'm just putting some benches and some uh, trash bins as well i will probably put some more detail in the near future but outside of this episode like trash in the ground things like that i did put some uh, not trash on the ground but some details around here and there but honestly uh, it's not too uh, according to the reality uh, itself so I will probably add a little bit more afterwards. Um, here you see me uh, also detailing uh, these um, crossings. Uh, I, I like to put the, the crosswalks with POs because I don't know, I just found it these ones that have a really, really nice texture, like it was used already. It's not uh, something that was painted fresh painted it's something that it looks like it belongs there for a while and i just like to enjoy using it um besides the plaza i also did this uh, white hospital i don't remember exactly the name 
but it's something like La Coruña Hospital, something like that. Uh, I'm not completely sure, but I just love this asset. This is really a fantastic hospital, taking in consideration it is an old building. It is supposed to be built in the center, in the core of the, of the city. So uh, for me, I just loved it and I will keep using them it on every single build I do. Uh, I did that on uh, on two previous uh, um, cities that I was building. I, I used it and I will use it on future cities because I love that building actually. Uh, here you see me detailing the surroundings of this hospital uh, near this main avenue. So I just managed to Put some uh, walls over there. Uh, now I'm building, I'm putting some stairs um, on the back to give access to those people that come by foot, uh, I would say. And uh, I also detailed with a great parking on the side because I think every single hospital has a big parking on it. So even if it's not really fulfilled, uh, because there is no, there is not that many uh, residents and commerce around it at the moment. I think in future he will be more or less uh, well, well fulfilled. Um, here you see me deploying some slope. I, I have me, I have made the decoration with these bushes, but I, I didn't like it. Uh, very, I didn't think it was very nice. So I managed to use those slope uh, networks. I think it's like that that we call them. And I just use it to, uh, just to, to make the impression that there was uh, grass over there, but manicured grass, uh, something that was taken care of and not just simple bushes uh, that gave a little not the, 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 the look that I really, really wanted. Uh, then I use this decal here. I, I really love this. Uh, this is for me one of the best decals about grass that we can uh, use. Uh, it's just so realistic. When you, look, when you look at it from no matter what angle, it just looks real. It just looks fresh cut uh, grass. So I just use it every single time I can. You will see me using everywhere, so uh, that's it. Meanwhile, uh, don't forget to follow uh, our social networks. So here on the top, you do see now, uh, the not the link, but uh, the page for Instagram. I am very, very active at, on Instagram. I do post uh, pictures from the game, from everything that I do in City Skylines every single day, more than one picture a day. And um, uh, I do, every time I go and make a stream, uh, I do publish here on the stories of the Instagram. So if you want to be, uh, how to say it, if you want to have news about me and what I'm doing, yeah, Instagram is the page you need to follow. Um, here I'm just making some more decoration. I'm just decorating a little bit of the inside uh, of this uh, hospital as well. With some benches, like the benches that people will use if they wait for people that is uh, uh, in, inside the hospital having some kind of, uh, I don't know, medical consults or medical issues. And the family just can, can come here, wait a little bit outside, have a little, smoke a little cigarette, something like that. On the back side, I went for more decoration with these two fountains. And I just deployed some uh, invisible uh, paths so that people can actually go around the um, uh, around the hospital and use this uh, part of the of 
of the city, I would say, of the park, as it was a park uh, that people could actually go through. Um, we are now reaching around 16 minutes of video, 16 and a half. And uh, I basically told you everything that I wanted to tell you. So <laughs> I don't know what else to say. Uh, here you just see me decorate a little bit more the parking area. That's uh, what I've been doing here. I did manage to put some more buildings around it so that on the cinematics it wouldn't become so strange and that this area could be a little bit more composed. Um, ah, I didn't talk to you about the tram station. I, I started with the tram station there and now I'm building, yeah, now I'm deploying the buildings around the tram station. And this tram station is honestly one of the best things I have decided to put in here. It just stays so, so nicely there that uh, I think, yeah, it was like it was ever born there. I, I, I don't know how to tell it in another way. Uh, here I built some buildings with the arcades. I managed to follow these arcades. Uh, with the, the corner building there and then I just deployed some more buildings around the tram station so that this could stay uh, completely full uh, and that's it guys uh, we are less than 40 seconds away from the cinematics so just hope you enjoyed the, this video don't forget to leave a like subscribe the channel to have to have to to have more news about the work that I'm doing. Uh, don't forget to come to Twitch to check out uh, our lives uh, from Monday to Friday every single morning. So uh, that's it. Hope you have enjoyed. Leave your like, uh, subscribe, comment and share with your friends. See you some other day. Stay care. Just falling over dreams Now I'm just so far gone This isn't what it seems Taking me so damn long It's fading from belief I need to slow this down It's burning